broadcasting from various countries around the world using voice over IP technology, this is VoIP Uncovered, a VoIP on Solutions UK podcast. I'm David Frith and joining us today is Alison Tetlow, UK Sales Channel Manager at SNOM. Thanks for joining us today, Alison. Thank you. Thanks, David. SNOM continue to produce leading VoIP solutions like the SNOM 300, 710 and 720. Could you tell us a little more about the newly released SNOM D715 and D725? Yeah, sure I can. Thanks, David. Um, The 700 series and the new D715 and D725 are perfect for a clear overview of numerous extensions, conference calls, and for those who consider their telephone to be a key tool in their daily work. The D715 provides high-speed connectivity thanks to its gigabit Ethernet switch. The USB port on the D715 enables greater flexibility functionality for the use of either USB headsets, the D7 expansion module, or Wi-Fi. Four SIP identities make the D715 flexible to use, and we maintain the SNOM standards for security and durability. The D725 is a great handset for maintaining an overview of a situation. It gives 18 freely programmable multicolor function keys in three rows, And this means that the D725 users have a complete overview of all calls at their fingertips. And of course, both handsets are built to SNOM's high standards for voice quality and durability, plus the elegant design that is a key characteristic of SNOM handsets. We're really expecting both these handsets to sell well into the UK businesses, particularly as our prices are highly competitive. That's great. Thanks, Alison. And how about the SNOM M65 deck phone and SNOM M700 multi-cell base station? Are there any developments on these? Well, um, the SNOM M series products were only launched last, last October, and so it's early days to talk about new developments. What I can say is the M65 IP deck phone, M700 multi-cell base station, and the M5 deck repeater were the first of the new wave of communication products that SNOM will bring to market in the coming months. The M65 handset combines business communications functionality with the intuitive features offered by mobile carriers. It's ideal for businesses that require mobile coverage across several floors or throughout large buildings. This new generation of SNOM deck phones integrates seamlessly with existing phone systems for presence, paging and other capabilities and it's far less expensive and offers better quality than cellular phones. Using the M700 multi-cell base station, businesses can deliver expanded coverage over several floors or throughout large buildings. They can link multiple M700 base stations together to form a network enabling free movement and seamless handover between base stations. The numbers are really impressive. The M700 in a multi-cell configuration can support up to 200 handsets, 40 base stations, and 100 repeaters, all in the same installation. Whilst the M65 phone is lightweight and elegant, it has a two-inch backlit color display and a backlit keypad for dialing in poor lighting conditions. Other features include wideband audio, including speakerphone, for the crispiest voice quality six polyphonic ringtones and vibration settings for incoming calls, dual internal antennas, reliable reception, with talk time of up to 17 hours between charges. When used with the new SNOM M700 base station, the M65 features voicemail, call forwarding, call list, call ID, direct search in a corporate directory, three-way conferencing, auto-answer, two simultaneous calls, and many other capabilities. The cordless deck phone offers expanded range and is operational up to about 130 feet beyond its base station. In a typical office environment, you can expect range of about 190 feet and about 300 feet for production areas without obstacles. SNOM's deck lineup gives business users, whether in an office building, conference hall, or production facility, the flexibility to be more mobile, which in today's environment is an absolute requirement. Okay, thank you. They sound very feature-rich products. So um, moving on to our next question. Aside from traditional desk phones and wireless deck phones, this non-meeting point has proven very popular. 
why should buyers be looking at dedicated conference phones? Um, well, meeting point is Snum's first VoIP conference telephone, and we believe it's a valuable addition for any business that requires frequent cross-location conference calls. Meeting Point provides the ideal mix of aesthetics and practicality and is well qualified for use in middle to large conference rooms. Its extremely reliable suppression of disturbing background noise and excellent sound quality means that telephone conferences can be held in large groups without affecting the uh, intelligibility of the call. Three speakers equipped with full duplex broadband audio provide balanced and full sound. In addition, Meeting Point provides the voice quality to a conference with all advantages of a SNOM voice phone. High security levels combined with features like SNOM CTI and support for 12 different SIP identities, which provide customers with the flexibility they need. The design of the Meeting Point integrates easily into the VoIP infrastructure of the business, plus it makes it a decent eye catcher for the conference room. Why should VoIP on customers purchase SNOM over phones such as Polycom, Gigaset and Yealink? I would like to say it's just because we are the best, but I don't think I could get away with that one. Realistically, customers buy on price and functionality and SNOM competes admirably in both these areas. But basically, <clears throat> I think you're asking me to explain some of the things that differentiate SNOM. I'd like to say that this is specifically our history and our expertise with industry standards, commitment to interoperability and innovation in our firmware. When you buy a SNOM handset, you are investing in a proven history of high quality, strong security and awareness and delivery of our customer needs. SNOM was developing endpoints based on SIP, the communication protocol for control based voice calls as far back as 1996. Before SIP, was even officially ratified as an industry standard in RFC 3261 under the Internet Engineering Task Force. We design every SNOM phone on the premise that it must be compatible with the widest range of SIP-based IP PBX providers, whether it be on-premise or in the cloud. It's a guiding principle of our design and development process. Our commitment to interoperability uh, and breadth of our interoperability partner program is second to none. We work tirelessly with service providers, open source developers, and SIP based platform developers to ensure that our phones are certified to work with the broadest range of IP services and equipment. Furthermore, we work with open source developers that offer resellers and end customers flexibility, customization, and lower cost. Another key differentiator is our firmware. It's the firmware that drives advanced out of capabilities like music on hold, boss stroke admin, call parking and forwarding, programmable buttons for presence. At SNOM, we are regularly updating our unique firmware where the driving force behind our status as the first SIP-based business phone maker to have our phones deployed with SIP-based IP PBXs. In the past year, SNOM has announced certification partnerships with more than a half a dozen leading SIP providers and we're constantly expanding our roster. I'd also like to add in, a, in another first, in September 2011, the SNOM 300 and SNOM 821 SIP phones became the first to achieve qualified for Microsoft Link status. Microsoft's top distinction for fully tested interoperability and compatibility with Microsoft Links. So what's the upshot of all this? I suppose it demonstrates not only SNOM's forward thinking approach to development, but also our commitment to quality, compatibility and interoperability, which ultimately maximises choice and functionality for small business, enterprise customers and service providers. OK, thank you very much for that thorough answer. And what does SNOM have planned for the next 12 months? Are there any new products we can expect to see? Well, yes, with our latest investment of capital, we expect to see a number of announcements over the next few months. Initially, it's the handsets we have covered today. That will be of most interest to our customers, we believe. The D715 and the D725 for the desktop and the M series of debt products. Next quarter, we're planning on a D765, 
and over time, a D375 will replace the present 370. We're also planning on expanding the M series range, consolidating our offering in the mobility area, as well as with new handsets in the middle of this year. That's excellent. Thank you very much. So there's some new products in the pipeline. So uh, I'm sure our customers and listeners will be very interested to see them later in the year. So thanks for joining us today, Alison. My pleasure and thank you and thank you to all. I hope you've all enjoyed listening. This has been a VoIP Uncovered podcast. For more information, please visit www.voipon.co.uk.